Hey everybody, today we're going to do our very first tour review over the Nova 2000 and the Nova 3 Blasting Hoods. So today we're going to talk about the Nova 3 and the Nova 2000 Blasting Helmets. Both of these helmets are absolutely great helmets. The only difference between the two is this one has a few less features than this one. The big thing between the Nova 2000 and the Nova 3 is the viewing screen. This is the Nova 3 screen. I don't know if you can see through the, the clear, this is the peel off. And this is a Nova 2000 screen, much smaller. <clears throat> they both use inner liners, which is this blue. You take the peeler off and this is your inner, your middle screen. And then they both have this, which is your hard screen on the inside, which protects you from any kind of hard debris that would come through the two outer lenses. Both of them have padded uh, insides like a, motor, a typical motorcycle helmet, but the Nova 3 has a ratcheting system on the inside, so you can actually adjust it to get the perfect fit. Um, the other big difference between the two is the Nova 2000 is a little bit cheaper. I think you can get these for around $325, $350, and the Nova 3 is going to be upwards towards $400. Both systems use the same in-air uh, quick connect on the back. And both of mine have these uh, air coolers, which brings cool air into the blasting hood. And I recommend these air coolers for anybody that's blasting in South Texas or even anywhere in Texas because they actually reduce the heat of the air coming into your hood by about 15 to 20 degrees. And in our Texas heat in the middle of the summer when it's 100 degrees outside, these are very, very helpful. Um, both of these have about the same size uh, screen on the front. You can tell this one's had several hundred hours worth of use. This one's green. Both are made by RBP. It's a safety company that specializes in blast protection. They sell the hoods. I'll put the part numbers for the hoods in the links below. They also sell these air coolers. They have two different versions of these. I prefer the lighter plastic one over the metal one just because you know it's easier to, to move around with. The air conditioner has uh, an adjustment knob on the back, so if it's a cooler morning, you can close it off and get your straight air through. If it's hot in the afternoon, the more you open it up, the cooler it gets. Now, one tip I will tell you, this little knob at the end gets very, very hot during the middle of summer. The more it's working to keep you cool, the hotter this thing's gonna get. So just keep that in mind on your back placement. As I said before, both of these hoods use the same peel-off type lenses. All you do is you reach over, you pull this little tab, and it just peels off kind of like a NASCAR. The two pieces separate. The ring stays with the hood, and this one you can just throw away. That's an easy way to, once this piece gets eaten up by sand or debris or ricochets or anything like that, and it gets hard to see, you just peel it off and it's easy to use. Now a couple of things about these hoods is when you're blasting wet, you're going to keep the peel offs to a minimum because the water actually gets in between them and it doesn't make it very, very uh, useful. It gets very, very frustrating. Um, as far as dry blasting, both of these hoods work great. This Nova 2000, I will say this little clip on the side does get caught on things and comes undone. On the Nova 3, they have eliminated that issue by having a smooth latch. It does this, same as that one, it's just smooth and doesn't get caught on nearly as much. As far as keeping you safe, both of these hoods are great. There are other hoods in the industry, but these from what I've used have been the most functional and comfortable. Now, just real quick for to show what it looks like, I'm gonna put the two hoods on and then take them right back off. It's very simple, just like a motorcycle helmet. You just slide your head in it. That's the Nova 2000. That one's a snug fit. There's no adjustment on the inside. This is the Nova 3. It has a ratcheting system on the inside, so it is much more comfortable, but it is a little more heavy. And there's the Nova 3. As you can see, very easy to put on and take off. Both of these hoods, like I've said, have had several hundred hours of use. Uh, the Nova 3 and the Nova 2000 are both holding up great to a lot of abuse. 
Um, the Nova 2, like I said, has its advantages. It is smaller, it's a little cheaper, but it is harder to see out of. Uh, and the side clip gets caught. The Nova 3 is a little more expensive. You get a much wider viewing area, but it does have the ratcheting system on the inside. Now both of these use the same air filter I was talking about earlier, the air cooler. They both use the same 3 8 inch quick connect. You make sure that you have clean, dry air coming off your system. RBP sells your air filter that goes off of your clean air system coming off your compressor. Make sure you look these up. RBP is a very, very good company. They're very reputable and they have not sponsored this video in any way, shape or form. So that was just a quick review of the Nova 3 and the Nova 2000 hoods from RBP Equipment. Make sure you look up their website. This, they did not sponsor this video.